Hey guys, James Ace here for a special edition of the Black and White Show for Anzac Day. Um, I've always watched the game between Essendon and, and Collingwood, so it's uh, very exciting to be able to play uh, Monday coming up. Uh, so we thought it would be a great occasion to get around all the boys and uh, just chat to them about Anzac Day and what it means to them. So uh, let's go. Tyson. Good morning, James. How are you? Yeah, fantastic. We've got Anzac Day on Monday, obviously, mate. We do. Talk us through, I guess you played in a few of them. What's it like? Uh, obviously the last post, pretty special day, so what's it like? Yeah, um, it is a very special day, obviously. From, um, yeah, it's just a, to, to pay tribute um, to what our, the fallen, the fallen men before us and women. Um, so it's a good day to, yeah, to pay tribute to them. I mean, yeah, people say that we're, we go to war, but it's nothing compared to what they did and they sacrificed their lives for the the better of this country, so um, it's a small token of appreciation that we can show, but yeah, it's a big day. I'm, we're fortunate enough to go to the, the dawn service, which is, is very good, so down at the shrine a few years back, and yeah, that's also a very moving moving scene. No, Anzac Day is the best day of the year, outside of um, finals, obviously, so it's the biggest crowd, probably outside the grand final. So it's, um, it's quite a privilege and, and an honour to play on you know, the biggest sporting day in Australia outside of out of finals. Do you happen to have any family relations or anything who have been involved in war over the time? Uh, yeah, my grandfather, so my uh, mum's dad was um, was fought in New Guinea in World War Two. So um, yeah, he's got a few medals and stuff. So Monday's a pretty special day for him. Yeah, I can remember back in school, you um, obviously get taught about the whole Anzac spirit and. Uh, what they did for us is pretty spectacular, so just to give a little bit back on the uh, Monday will be yeah, unreal. You know, the last post and the anthem and stuff is, is pretty incredible to be out there, um, you know, standing there while it's all going on and, you know, hearing 100,000 people deadly silent, you know, it's, um, it's a pretty awesome experience and I guess hopefully you get to experience that for the first time on Monday and, um, you know, for all the, the people who, who don't bury for a Collingwood resident, um, you know, I, I tell them one thing they should do is, is go to an Anzac Day at least some point in their life because it is a pretty memorable day. To hear the, the a packed MCG fully silent and giving 100% respect for for what, what these guys have done for our history um, and for what our, our present day um, society looks like, it's just, it's just amazing and you get tingles down your spine and, um, Again, I, it's, it's just amazing to be, and I'm so grateful to be a part of it. What about just, I guess, the lead up to the games are massive, and um, how, how have you found that, just being a part of the lead up? Yeah, for sure. Um, yeah, unfortunately, I was a Bomber supporter before coming here, so um, I followed the, the <laughs> schedule pretty uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> heavily. Um, but yeah, no, it's a huge build up. Um, I obviously played in it last year, and it was pretty unforgettable. Um, the whole few days leading into it, and that morning's. Uh, Remarkable, and then that minute of silence, and uh, the last post is yeah, something I'll never ever forget. Um, we're heading to the shrine tomorrow. Um, obviously, first year at the club for both of us. So, how are you feeling about that? Yeah, mate, I'm uh, I'm pretty excited. So I've heard a lot about it from all the other boys, and um, yeah, I'm keen to see what it's about. So I've heard some pretty good stories. Yeah, it was a long time ago now for me, but uh, yeah, it was really great to get over there and um, learn a lot more about the day. I, I didn't know um, a hell of a lot of it um, before I came to the football club, so um, just, to, just to learn and um, I suppose find out a bit more about what um, those veterans went through um, back in the day is, is pretty special and I think pretty important. Uh, hopefully first game for us for Collingwood on Anzac Day, so how are you feeling for that? Um, excited is probably one of the first words that come to mind. Um, obviously a big occasion. Um, used to celebrate the day pretty pretty solid back home. It was always an eventful day, but um, yeah, I guess being able to be involved in such a big occasion would be an honour and a privilege. So I'm looking forward to it and uh, yeah, hopefully we can both run out there for the first time on the big day. All right, that's it for today, guys. Hope you enjoyed watching. Uh, and hope you're looking forward to getting to the game on Monday. Uh, I know everyone at the club can't wait to get out there and have a good performance. Um, these are the Guernseys we're wearing, so proceeds go to the RSL. Um, so if you can get along to the game and uh, get one of these and support us, uh, it'll be terrific. Um, so let's hope for a good day and go Pies.